Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a great day. Just want to go through uh, an update on how our piglets are doing, but also talk about our 16 by 16 paddocks and actually be able to show you how we build them, how quickly it takes us to do it. But I want to go through the process of what we have here. So the first thing is that we have the great Cornish, uh, gray broilers uh, that we have grown here, our meat birds. Uh, but they weren't here uh, at originally. They were in a smaller paddock and they got too big for the smaller paddock, so we had to move them in here. In order to move them in here, though, we had to get the turkeys out. Uh, in order to move the turkeys, we had to move the piglets. So you see here, after 12 days of moving the piglets, what they've been able to do to the ground, how they've uprooted it, uh, which is fantastic. They've done a great job of that. We're moving them almost every day in order to do that. And you may think that that takes a lot of time and energy to do that, but what we're gonna show you in a little bit is a video of how quickly it goes with three people doing it. Uh, but we got the turkeys out once we got the piglets out and morgan if you could show up there where the turkeys are that's a paddock that we're going to show you a video on us setting it up and it literally took only 13 minutes to set that up and we're going to show that with the video um, once we were able to get them in there that's only a temporary uh location for them we want them back out here in the field we want them eating bugs and grass uh, and not just feed and being in dirt all the time. That is not what we want. We want them back out here, not only for the bird's health, uh, but also for the people that are looking at and interested in buying from us on these turkeys. Uh, when Now that they're in there, we've got the meat birds in here. We've got turkeys over there, and we're gonna work on getting them out. And we've got the piglets going over to the larger paddock. So everything has been working really well. Again, this is something that we learned that it has worked well for us. It may not work for everybody, but we just wanted to show this idea to you guys. So it's, it's something that maybe you're interested in. If not, then it may not be something that fits your farm or your homestead. But I hope you enjoy the video just to get an idea. I uh, just wanted to show you as well on the paddock that we built. These are the clamps that we use. You can get them from Home Depot, any hardware store, Lowe's, Tractor Supply. They're about $1.45. This is what we have holding onto the T-post, the hog panels and they have worked extremely well. Very quick to take off, very quick to put on. Uh, but hopefully you enjoy the video. Again, uh, thank you for supporting us and, uh, and watching our videos. Have a great day.